Hello Pisces, welcome to my channel. My name is Catherine from Soul Siren Tarot, here to do your June reading. All right, as always, it's a general reading. It's not going to resonate with everybody. If it does, great. I hope it helps you, Pisces. If it doesn't, just kick it to the curb. If you know somebody would help, please do share. All right, if you haven't already, please do subscribe to the channel. Whoa. Uh, and also, I'm going to take that. And also, um, I am open to private readings. If you're interested in that, the link I know to get that is below in the description box. Basically, email me at soulsarantaro at gmail.com. All right, guys, here we go. Pisces. Right, this is interesting because I'd pre blessed the deck as I always do. And what came out was the Seven of Cups, right? This is lovely, right? Because this is many options opening up, right? But you've become wise now to understand that, you know, not everything that glitters is gold if you look at the snake here and things like that, right? So I always feel like it's you've got that discernment now and you've got it because Pisces, look at this, right? You've manifested it, the star here. Wish is coming true, wish fulfillment. Can you say she's off the ground? No, she was barren. She had to rebuild, but all the magic's back. And I always feel like, you know, this is like, it's like the Ace of Cups, isn't it? It's like your dreams coming true. So Pisces, it's really nice because I feel like things, I want to say, are about to get off the ground, right? Maybe you've been waiting a while. Maybe you've been building something. It's not been moving as quickly as you'd like. Or, you know, you just feel you're in a constant, when is when are the doors going to open? You know, when are the winds of change going to happen? I see they're going to happen. But I'm going to say it in a way that says don't jump at the first one because, you know, you use that, that discernment that you've earned through quite frankly having been burnt in the past right that's what I feel because there is still some healing here when the star shows and you don't get the star unless you've been through the hell and high storm do you Pisces you know that right so this is lovely because I feel like it's a refresh of energy almost a refresh of energy yeah look you got it's lovely palace of coins here in this particular deck they've got a palace for each of the suits okay palace of coins is about getting to a place of stability you know abundance but also it always can you see if you look in the corner there can you see the owl as well right and that's what i feel it's saying to us with this seven of cups this star energy being wise using your discernment right things that probably in your past pisces were important to you and you know we all go through this i'm not saying you know you're full of ego but it can be you know things that are like status or money or job title or you know this sort of rubbish i think um because it, in the end it didn't make you happy it's just it's just so you can say this is what i am this is what i do right this is a pisces who's stepping back after being hurt and said you know what all i want is peace joy in my life happiness and relaxation and that pisces is what you've drawn in that's what you've created and that's why you're wise like the owl now right because you can see what's real and what isn't material isn't real you know it's how we feel inside because that in itself lifts that vibration doesn't it which builds your ability to manifest speeds up your ability to manifest yeah lovely look coming out of this i'm not sitting in this anymore this five of cups energy looking down at the three cups fell over everything gone wrong grief unhappiness tired so tired i can't see the two beautiful cups behind me i'm just all like you can see this one's got nothing left to give down broken and out pisces that's where you were you're not about to revisit that place i'm just going to take a sip of my drink i'm suffering badly with allergies i'm sorry mm. It's terrible, it's got my eyes dry, my throat dry, <laughs> coughing, right, just coughed all through Aquarius reading, bless them. Right, okay, here we go, come on for Pisces, yeah, yeah, look, next to that seven, uh, five of cups, seven of swords, sneaky, sneaky behaviour, you don't want to be around this anymore, people coming back, wanting more and more off you, stabbing you in the back front, bloody face center everything yeah don't even care but can you say that one's looking back yeah and i felt it in aquarius as well there's and, and and there's a lot of people returning at the moment um you know sneaking back in realizing what they gave away i want to say and that might be you know because i thought is it because i was asking myself for is it because it's been locked down and they've not been able to and now all of a sudden you know they've got the chance and that's why there seems to be so many but i don't i think people even 
narky narkies have, have realized what's really important in this life having been through what we've been through that's what i feel now don't get me wrong be careful the narky will never change never change they can't they can't it's a condition right so don't go there but um but yeah, I just, I just get a sense of people swinging back around. But this is a Pisces who's grown so much and into that Palace of Coins energy, which is a lovely, nurtured, happy energy. I, you're not going to give that up easily. I don't feel it. Right, this one's not going away. Knight of Cups. In one of these cups, this that's been offered, right, there's a knight on its way as well. This is an offer of love, right, Pisces. So this is slow moving, takes a minute to come in, but when it does, it's reliable, it's solid, it's worthy, right? So I feel there's a love um, coming towards you as well, Pisces, if you're single, right? Maybe if you're not as well, I suppose, but um, it's an offer of true love coming your way that you can trust. So it's a night, so it's moving forward, it's incoming, right? And it's justice, you've deserved this. You deserve this, Pisces, having been left out in the cold, right? This is your justice. The scales are being balanced. And again, I'm swung back to that, that Seven of Swords, wondering why is that other one from the past coming? And I think it's two things. I think they know you're moving on with someone new or you've got someone new in your life, but they also can see the lovely world that you're creating, have created for yourself, Pisces, this palace of coins. And they're thinking that looks juicy, juicy. I'd like some of that. That's what I'm feeling. They want what you've got. Right, well, you're not going to give it because you know what you deserve. That's what I feel this Pisces is. They abandoned you. Look at this. Couldn't be clearer. Right, they abandoned you, left you out in the cold. They probably left you, Pisces, at the worst time in your life. You know, when you were at your lowest, when you were really struggling, when you needed them. Right, and you've had to rebuild from that energy, that five of coins energy, to get into your palace of coins and that's not fucking easy it's not easy you have to get up from a broken heart as well with this five of cups energy here right look at this forcing yourself through your death and rebirth absolutely beautiful and you've done it pisces you've absolutely done it right and they know it and that makes you like they're scared of you, fearful of you, because as you get strong, they know you see more and more exactly what games they played and what they did. That's a scary place for them. But you're not going to let it distract you from your bright new beginning. You're just not, because I feel, look at this, lovely. Pisces has got the faith. You have been through, coming after that death and rebirth, you are now spiritually awakened, yeah? And so, in a way, we're thankful to that idiot from the past, aren't we, male or female, whoever it was for you. We're thankful because it helped us go through our spiritual awakening. And even though that was hard, we wouldn't have done it without that pain. So thank you to them, even though they're, you know, not worth the words I want to say, right? Yeah, because you're solid now. You know, you know what's important, like we said earlier on with that faith card. It's not material it's not job titles it's not how much do i earn it's none of these things it's am i happy you know do i wake up happy and excited for my day do i go to bed feeling peaceful joyful and relaxed and then in between just floating on air i know life's never going to be you know a bed of roses and nor is it meant to be because we wouldn't grow would we but it's not unnecessary stress, unnecessary strain. That's what I want to say, Pisces. Okay. Okay. Tell us more about this going forward. I want to know more about going forward. The security that's coming up for this Pisces. Oh, wow. Two palaces now, right? Palace of Wands, right? Which is a palace of passion. Now, I think this is where you're moving through the palaces. You get your own uh, abundance and security with your palace of coins there. And then you turn it into your mad passionate palace of wands because it's coming over that seven of cups and that knight of cups right this is now passion love joy you know so i think you're moving into a very passionate happy relationship pisces you know and and it's it's like because now you've got yourself sorted in other words you've got your security in place you feel in a more stable place you've healed from the past that now you're ready to blossom yeah and do you know it's interesting because aquarius had it where i felt they were hiding themselves away but i feel you're further on than that pisces it's like pisces is ready to rock and roll that's what i feel it is an absolute soulmate that's coming to you a true soulmate six of cups can't make it up can you past life connection true love blossoming between these two over that star over that justice it's coming towards you and it's coming towards you fast right so you know whether you're out dating now or not 
it's still going to happen, right? The divine will make it happen when it's meant to happen. To just know it. I'll take a little sip of my drink. I'm losing my breath. Bless you. Thank you for your patience. Okay. I always get it, don't I, this time of year? All right. Okay. For my lovely Pisces. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Right. Look, Palace of Wands, Six of Cups, Soulmate, the Lovers. Right. But it's interesting because you might be tested, Pisces, because remember as well, the Lovers can be a choice between two. And I do think it's where this one from the past is going to try and sneak back in, take away some of your happiness. But I truly, truly believe, Pisces, you're not going to let them in. Right. You're just not going to get let them in. You've done your healing. Yeah. Yeah. It's like get lost to them, you know, shutty, shutty. That's what I'm going to say. Shutty, shutty to the ex. Welcome to the new. That's what I feel, right? Yeah, I'm not putting up with the bullshit. Look at this. I learned. I went through that dark night of the soul. I'm not going through it again. I'm wise again. Card of wise. This is the hermit because he takes the hurt, stops on his travels for a minute, shines the light of introspection on it to say, okay, what, what happened there? How did it happen? How did I allow myself to get so wounded? And then moves forward. That's coming over that five of cups and that death and rebirth, right? So I'm confident whoever I'm connecting with, this, this other one's got no chance. It's the new one coming in and this new one is going to be so beautiful, so loyal and, and, and just a true knight of cups, you know, that turns into a king of cups. Yeah, your wish fulfillment, absolutely, Pisces. You're happy, 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 right? That's what I feel. Happy like a dog in muck. Is that what they say? A pig in muck, a pig in muck, isn't it? <laughs> right? That's what I feel. Yeah, just so happy. Um, that it's like you can't believe it. It's all coming in at once. And I'm not just saying it because I have to give bad readings too sometimes. But you've been through the pain here, Pisces. You've built your solid. And we saw that all through. Um, last year and this year didn't we building that solid foundation and it does take time it takes time to heal and build that but you're like there now and now it's time to welcome in the true one that's what I want to say welcome in the true one now yeah it's time Ooh, Pisces lovely right I'm going to take an energy card for you uh, and then a vibe card, see what your vibes are, okay, because there's nothing, nothing more to say on this, it's just absolutely beautiful, right, thank you, spirit, thank you, for Pisces, for Pisces, I'm sorry for coughing, I've had my way through this reading, look, oh wow, absolutely lovely, right, the divine matrix, I said to you, You've been through your spiritual awakening. You see things in a completely different way now. You're up in the 4D, 5D looking down. Your 3D is a 3D. You're not interested in it anymore. And that's why the, these ones that are stuck in that, these ones who want to backstab you, they can't hurt you because you just see things from a higher plane. You allow the, the divine to deal with the idiots, the clowns, the, the bad ones. You just keep pressing forward and you don't let it get under your skin. And you want what's real, what is real in this life, right? Not the pretend, not the, you know, material. Just leave it there. Okay. So, oh, coming to the vibe cards for this gorgeous. Go look at that. Right. They do make me laugh. As soon as I split it, they tell me it's showing it me. I'll probably take it, right? It says, accept the gifts of the universe. That's what we've just been saying. Yeah, the universe will give me everything I need when I need it. I'll be blessed with that and I'll be happy for it. Yeah, I'll feel joyful for it and I'll appreciate it so much more because I'm not sat in a load of fear and worry and panic and anxiety, right? That's where this Pisces is. And I'm with someone, a partner who I can trust implicitly implicitly they would not let me down that's what this pisces is saying and it's that knowing <laughs> yeah absolutely yeah it's that knowing of it and they're saying you know look at this take your time know it's going to happen i said earlier whether you're <coughs> excuse me online dating not online dating you know they were looking around the corner all the time for it don't it's just gonna happen you just be you do you every day yeah working on you allow the time you know know you've grown you know i often say don't i sometimes you know what we don't do enough is you know sit down for a minute just sit down for a minute and look 
back at everything you've achieved in terms of you and your personal growth and how I want to say healing out of this shit situation as well with that star there I want you to you know really really see how much you've done how much you've grown and give yourself that pat on the back for it because we forget to do that we forget to do that sometimes right we do and then next to it it says take your time because with it came call on your runners and I love this this always makes me feel can you I was thinking like at the bottom here's looking at the window you know with the lights and things I just feel like like you, you, this is manifestation for me. You're calling your resources in that you need, that you want in a beautiful, energetic way, yeah, as you're ready. But allow everything time to come together. Allow it to do that. Know that the assistance is there because you know it. We're all energy and it's divine matrix. You know where you are. You understand now and you accept the gifts that, like it said, and just allowing it to happen in divine timing and being relaxed in that energy. That's what I feel. And this one coming back up, shutty, shutty. We're not interested, right? This is a Pisces who's absolutely moved the fuck on, right? And that's what it is. Pisces, it's lovely for you. So I don't know if it was said just to sort of relax you, you know, cool, cool your jets for a minute, <laughs> you know, cool your jets, don't worry. They are coming in, but give them time to come in. Yeah, remember who you are and remember how wise you've become and remember what you've survived, right? And also what you own, owns you, doesn't it? Right, so the bigger the house, the more money, the more material, the harder work that is. That's the way I see it, right? You know, and, and the more worry there can be with it too. So, you know, I just feel it's almost like you've gone back to birth, but gone back to basics with that star there because you were forced to because of a hurtful situation. But actually, you found out that it's not actually that bad there after all. Pisces, I'm going to leave it there because I'm running out of breath anyway. All right, guys, I'm sorry, I'm sniffling through your reading, but I, this, I just this will be me now for for June. Um, all right, so um, if you haven't already, please do subscribe. Help us keep the channel running. Um, and I, I do do private readings. If you do want one, link below. But soul soul siren tarot at gmail.com. All right, Pisces, I will see you very soon. Love and light.